Yeah, uh, this wasn't on my Metalcore 2023 uh, bingo card. We have Meg the Horse, also known as Megan the Stallion, who is literally one of the biggest rappers in the world doing a collab with Spirit Box. And of course, Spirit Box is coming off their brand new EP, Fear of Fear, which is banger, by the way. I've reacted to most of the tracks on it on this channel and it's just like yeah so perfect timing for this for spirit box this is a remix of megan's track that came out a week ago called cobra they really called it a rock remix of it the original it's it's pretty decent like i listened to it just on spotify it has some cool like just random guitar moments it even has like a kind of pseudo guitar solo at the end and just the original version that sounds like it's going through a pod farm in 2001 but hey it gets the job done and it, it's got a bit of an edge to it and, and the actual beats are like like decent the melodies are cool like it's honestly something i probably would have myself done a proof anything is can be metal with but with this what's also really cool is that if you go here on spotify she actually included it in a little bit of like a single compilation which includes the original track and this rock remix we're about to listen to which is huge and you can also see on this rock remix if you go here to spirit box i'm pretty sure spirit box have primary on this track <laughs> Meaning that they also get the streams and monthly listeners that Megan gets from this song. She's at 22.5 million monthly listeners. So, um, yo, <laughs> just, I don't, I don't even care how it sounds. Yo, congrats to Spearbox. This is a huge thing. Like, big congrats. That's, that's sick. So, I mean, yeah, let, let's see what they did with it. There's already, like, dun-dun chunky guitars in the original one. So, like, I guess down tune it and make it so it doesn't sound like it was recorded on a nokia and i guess we'll be good okay i did not see the video but i'm assuming it's going to be extremely sexualized and caleb's going to have to blur most of it thank you youtube also did you know that 47 percent of you aren't subscribed hit the subscribe button down below hit the notification bell. come hang out we do fun metal things here it's a snack jesus christ you already have to blur that <laughs> you definitely have to blur that caleb <laughs> It's just pure ass. She is fully naked. Okay. I got like bad bitch vibes. Got the ambience. Ass again. <laughs> just repeat her coming out of a snake. Is that the visualizer? <laughs> Okay. Yo, the flow is. I'll, I'll say that the the flow goes pretty hard with with these with these guitars and the ambience. It's very spirit box. It's, it's it's a cool blend. It's a cool blend so far. Just sounds like new metal to be honest. Modern new metal. Ooh, Courtney. Damn, I didn't expect that to blend so well. That's blur most. Just blur the video, Caleb. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I didn't expect this, Jay. This is a sick combo. Oh, that background. The, the, it sounds so evil and fun. And it really works with her rap flow, weirdly enough, man. That's... Okay. Show, Spearbox showing me how to do proof anything can be metal. Damn. Bro, that's hard. Got some rars. Coming into this. This is a real remix. Like, this is like. Megan said we're doing modern metal core rap. Damn, Gordon. Bro, I haven't heard Courtney scream like that since, like, like early EP of Spirit Box. Like, those are, like, angry, angry, like, banshee rars. What the f***? <laughs> it works! I feel like the... This is the thing. I feel like with the video, people, like, the metalheads are just gonna not be happy because they're, like... 
you know, it's it's very pop and half naked women everywhere. Sonically, this is this is sick. This is this is dope as f dude. The lyrics work really well, weirdly, with Courtney's voice and Spearbox's vibe. We out? We out. So that's the... Okay, so I got... That's so funny, because at the end here in the original... There, there's like a like it's it's really shitty guitar solo, but a little kind of like lead guitar solo again through like a pod farm. So that's so funny because I would say that that was probably the most you know metal part of the original song. And Spirit Fox just we're like guys, like no, we we can't. It's not good. <laughs> so that's funny that Spirit Fox didn't even bother including the lead weird like lead guitar rough you know chug solo at the end that had the original had, but they included the like the they played on the chugs throughout the theme of the original song which is really cool and then they expand upon it it just sounds very modern and huge and Courtney's voice especially during this bridge bro like hey, think it's going down now we stand corrected hey this must be the best clue I'm about to I ain't going higher no emotion no I'm like that's that's hard as f bro <laughs> Like, I can imagine Megan just playing this shit live randomly and Courtney coming on stage and just, you know, queening that shit up and just being a badass. Like, that's so sick. Like, did she release this on her? She's like, this is, like, yeah. She, she was like, fuck yeah, RARS. <laughs> like, again, I know a lot of pop artists, especially nowadays, and, like, alternative artists and rap artists, like, hard with metal but it's it's cool to see the combination and it'd be a lot more seamlessly accepted into the into the mainstream realm because this is not something that would always be happening <laughs> you know? like having a part like this oh my god i paused right on ass ed sheeran bring me the horizon who like this is this is hard this is modern metal with rap it honestly just sounds like new metalcore. Like, modern metal bands are making songs like this. And, and I gotta give, like, mad credits to Spirit Box for making this happen and management and everyone else on label. Good shit. But also, I guess, Megan the Haunts for um, being cool as f*** with this. Because, like, that's sick. This is... So many people are going to be exposed to Spirit Box and, and RARS because of this. <laughs> it's just so, so random. It's so it's such a random thing to happen. It's like, uh, what? Like, I didn't, I didn't expect to wake up to be like, yeah, Megan the Stallion and Spirit Box, bro. And it's not like Spirit Box doing a cover. No, this is an official remix. I like how they call it a rock remix. It's definitely like a modern metal remix. But, you know, they had to be uh, word safe for the, for the normies, I guess, and call it rock instead. This is sick. Mix sounds sick. Oh my god, I keep pausing on ass. And this verse, too, with Courtney um, coming and singing is just so sick. Yeah, I, I don't really have much else to say. This is cool. Like, big congrats to Spirit Box for getting this to happen. Because anytime stuff like this happens, it's, it's just like, it's always a win for the metal scene. Even if you f***ing hate it. Like, if you sat here and you're like, Nick, this is worse than the ass, right? That is ass. And there's a lot of ass on screen, too. Hey, that's chill. It's fine. Not your thing. But this is a huge win for just, just a nice dub. More people exposed to, 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 rah, yeah, yeah, I say so. And, uh, dun, 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 you know, like, big W. I love you, Spirit Box. Let's go. Perfect off the repeat. I guess it's like Spirit Box week for me, because I got this and I got, yeah. Thank you, Meg the Haunts. Done. Caleb, do something funny at the end. Bye. Haunts.